What's up guys, welcome back to Shack. It's Waz here and this is going to be a quick tutorial on how to fix PS3 controllers not working with Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. So we're going to use Padstar and uh, there'll be a link for that in the description below for where you can get it. Uh, I have it downloaded already so I'm just going to open it up. Now one thing to note is your controller should be attached to your computer before you open up Padstar. And before I forget, we'll need a profile to go along with the game so head on to this website. I'll leave a link in the description below where you can get it. So download the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 game profiler for Pinnacle. Don't be alarmed, it will work with Padstar. I have it downloaded already so let's open up Padstar. Alright, so let's hit the settings, go to import from file, so we load our uh, profile that we downloaded, you select that, open it up, and yes, let's hit yes. Um, so yeah, so we select the game, the location of the game, I have it on my desktop, so I select Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, OK to continue, it imports the profile data, and it's going to look, it's every, this successful okay so this really put click okay and uh you go to the edit where the pen and notepad is uh pencil or notepad or whatever and it opens up the control so this is what it looks like and uh since you have have uh, imported a profile for God, uh, modern warfare 3 it's going to like set things up already for you and if you have any problem any issues with any of the controls uh you can just edit it up here so if you're trying it for the very first time, like many of you, run the wizard and uh, click on continue. Choose the uh, the controller you have, and I'm just going to do it according to what I have here. And then you get to this point. So this is where you're going to set up your control. All right. So you skip the first part and you follow the instructions. And you drag according to the layout you want it. And to make things easy, just follow the, the layout you have on your controller. So from here onwards, I'm just going to forward the whole thing. All right, and we're done. Let's exit the wizard. You go to the pencil and notepad, and this is how your control is going to look like. If you want to edit anything here, just select the button you want to edit. You go here, assign command, and you change whatever it is you want to change. And let's go back to game launcher, hit the play button, and let's test what we have set. Ooh, pad start. Yes, you can see, guys, it's working all right. And ouch! Oh shit, a grenade. Alright guys, if you haven't subscribed, be sure to do that and also give the video a thumbs up. It's, ouch, that was that for payback assholes. And be sure to give us a thumbs up if you liked the video and share the video out there for others so you can also benefit from this. And before the next video comes out, peace out, stay safe.